Good day viewers, my name is Agul Samson, live from Aquatech Farms. On this video, we shall be discussing on how to reduce cannibalism in your catfish archery operations. Now, one of the ways to reduce um, cannibalism, you agree with me that catfish are, are they are cannibals in nature. This means that they predict on themselves. And naturally, when um, you stock them upon, they grow. Um, the growth rate can never be even so the big ones at some point in time predict on the smaller ones and thereby this reduces the quantity of output you get from the artery so one of the ways to try to reduce this to the barest minimum is a routine management that is carried out in the artery called sorting sorting is grading of fishes into their various sizes and this will reduce cannibalism drastically in your culture system so on this video i'll be showing you a practical approach to how you carry out your sorting in the hatchery, a less stress sorting operation in the hatchery. I'm still on the grading and um, sorting exercise. You need to get baths of those sizes. You need to get about three or four. Then, um, yeah, the graders, um, these are the locally made um, grader. You can get this if you contact me on my, you can contact me on how to get this. So this grader of various sizes, you can see this, we get um, the juvenile posts and um, we have down to the fries from um, two, three weeks old fries. This is another size and here's another size. It's a five size, but it's up to six or seven sizes. Um, so still in the um, grading process, here's a deal thing we got to do now. Um, the fish has been evacuated from this tank into a bath and we have um, three baths here that are empty. We want to grade them into their sizes. And this particular set of fish have already been graded with the size. So obviously we're not going to get um, any sizes of those fish coming out from this uh, um, bath right now. So from this um, grader. So we're starting with the immediate next grader. That is this, a little bit bigger. You can see let me show you you can see the sizes so, so these are a little bit bigger these are the next size um to this so we're starting with this and um, after that we'll move to the grader three you can see the difference then um to grader four i'm starting right away we i'm starting with this so the, it has to come into the smallest grader first And this is what you do, right? Then you move it to the next size. So gently pour the fish in here. Can you see? We've actually removed about. Um, We've graded this into three sizes. I'm looking at this. You can see these are a bit bigger. They cannot. Um, we can't use this next grader because all of them, actually, all the sizes here, would go off this. So you get this into another tank. So just from this particular batch, with the aid of the grader, one, two, we've been able to remove um, the sizes. Can you see the size of this? This is about um, 1.5 um, centimeter in length. Look at the next size. Hope you can see the difference. You can see these are way much bigger than the first size. And look at the third sizes. And already we have um, those three sizes in a pond already. So this is what you do continuously till you get your desired result. Like I told you, one of the benefits of this constant grading is to reduce cannibalism. Also, these fish that are sorted in their various sizes will now have uniform growth and they will grow rapidly because when you launch in feed into this pond or into these tanks, you discover that 85% to 90% of the fish will have access equal rights to the feed launch into the pond because they are of the same size so there's no intimidation and cannibalism will be totally reduced so this is the positive effect 
of constant grading in your artery. You do this to aid even growth and um, to reduce cannibalism, thereby having much stocks rolling out from your artery. So here are the sorted fishes and um, you can see their uniform in sizes in their various tanks and you can see how active they have. These are the advantages of um, sorting. Feel free to like and share and also subscribe to this channel if you've not subscribed, if you're viewing the station for this channel for the first time. Then also comment on the um, comment section on topics you want me to discuss about as regard catfish farming business.